In today's video, I will show you step by step how we can create a paid Discord server through warp.com. Now, first of all, once we are signed in or, you know, created an account and we are on the main homepage right here, what we can do is come up to the top right hand corner and then click on start selling. Once we click on start selling, you will then be redirected over to this page. And then what you want to do now is click on the start selling button. From there, what you would get is this page right here and you want to start off by giving your store a name. So name it whatever you like. And then if you want to add your Twitter account, you can add this, but this is optional. So if you're happy, we can click on next. From here, you want to go ahead and choose the category that your store will, you know, lie under. Um, for me, I will just go ahead and select how to course, for example, and then click on next again. From there, you will be on your main dashboard. And then once we are on our main dashboard, we want to click on set up product. And then you will be on this page right here. Now, what we want to do to add our discord is head over to browse apps. Here is where you will see all of the different apps that WAP does offer. Now, what we want to do is click on discord access. And then you will now need to click on connect discord. From here, you want to click on connect to Discord server. So you will have to have created a Discord server prior to this. If not, you can create one now and come back to this step. So click on connect Discord server. That will then redirect us over to here. And if you are signed in already, you need to sign in. And then you want to click on the drop down menu for add a server and select the server that you want to be a paid membership and a paid Discord. So for example, I will click on this one, click on continue, click on authorize on this page, and then you need to complete the verification. So once we have completed the verification, you will be on this step right here. And this step is very, very important. So what we need to do now is we need to head over to our discord. So if I head over to my discord now, as you will notice, the what bot is now inside my discord. And to make this work correctly, what we need to do is go to the top left hand corner, click on the drop down menu, go to server settings and then on the left hand side bar here you will now see an option for roles if we click on roles as you will notice what bot is also located in this section and what we want to do is we want to click and then drag this to the top of this page right here once we do this we can then click on save changes and then we can then go back over to our previous tab now, what you want to do now is click on test roles. And if this is done correctly, what you'll get is a message saying that Discord has now been connected. And as you can see there, the Discord has now been connected. So we can then click on complete. Once we click on complete, we can then head back over to our products. We can then click on this right here is which is what we've just created. And from here now, what we can do is add pricing options. So if we click on add pricing options, you will get the option for free subscription and a single one-time payment. Now, what you'll do is click on subscription or single one-time payment, whichever you prefer. And then for example, if we click on subscription, this will be a recurring monthly fee that people do need to pay in order to keep access to your Discord. Now, what you want to do is set the price. So for example, if I just put in something like $99, for example, you can click on the drop down menu for per month which will give you different options right here for the billing period. Now you can have, you know, per month, per six months, per year, every week, and so on and so forth. Choose the one that you want. And then you can then go and choose the currency that you want right here. So once you've done this, you can come down and you can enable credit and debit card. You can disable this and you can also enable and disable PayPal. If you go down a little bit further, you've got options for free trials, one-time initial fees, and so on. So if you want a one-time initial fee, for example, click on the toggle and then set the fee in this box right here. Once you've changed all of these settings in this box right here, you've got different ones on the side that you can change, but the main ones that you will need are in the pricing section at the top of this. And then once we do that, we will then be able to click on save. Now, once we click on save, if you've done this correctly, as you will notice, you will see the, you know, pricing and stuff for your Discord right here. You will see also any active members inside your Discord. And this means it has been done correctly. And then you will then be able to start, you know, selling the Discord server. So it's just that simple, guys. That's how you can create a paid Discord server on WAP.com. If this video helped you out, please leave a like on today's video. And I will see you in the next one.